What's going on guys? So I got a question from cross mode and actually quite a few people not a lot But like, you know, there was a significant number of people to warrant me doing a quick follow-up video To my how to install League of Legends on Linux And I thought that this was even more appropriate since that uh, Riot is actually releasing a new client And we're going to have to figure out how to I guess fix all the bugs in that client now that it's coming out So uh, this video is going to be on how to debug applications in wine using play on Linux it's actually really super simple. So what you're going to do is you're going to come into Wine here and you're going to choose the application that you want to debug. And for me, League of Legends works and so it's not going to produce a very nice uh, or useful debug output since there won't be any actual errors in there. But Cinema 4D doesn't actually work and it's an application that I'm working on at the moment to try and get working. So I'm going to go to Cinema 4D and make sure it's highlighted and then I'm going to hit debug. And as you can see here, what's going to happen is my application will crash and I'm going to get the uh, errors and stuff in here. This is, um, I think this is the crash dump. And it also provides uh, the stack trace and all sorts of other things uh, that happened. It also provides the function calls and all those kinds of things. And so um, for those of you who aren't very technical but just wanted to set up League of Legends on Linux, that's fine. Uh, for those of you who wanted support in actually getting it set up, all I need is this crash dump here. And so what you're going to do is hit close and just wait a few seconds and it's going to further freak out. So you're just going to hit next. And I need this massive looking crash dump here. So what you're going to do with this crash dump is you're going to copy this whole thing here. Um, or you can locate the log file. And in fact, that's probably better. So we say locate this log file. Uh, name play on Linux. Okay. And so as you can see here in our wine prefix, we've got the C4D prefix, which is the hard drive for Cinema 4D. So if you just go ahead and open that with like gedit or something, I don't really mind what you open it with. Um, so as you can see here, this is the entire crash dump and I need to look through this and figure out why it's not working uh, for some people and it is working for most people. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to gist.github.com and I'll just pull this over here. And you're going to press, uh, you're going to paste this into here and just call it like lol crash dump dot log. And just hit, if you can either make it public or secret, it's up to you guys. You can either send it to me via a private message or you can post it in the comment section below. Um, but so just hit uh, create public gist. And once you've done that, just simply grab this link here and uh, make sure that there's nothing that you're unhappy with sending to me in this crash dump. I mean, I know it's kind of long, but um, for me, it looks like uh, I have some direct X issues with Cinema 4D, which is a really good indicator so of where to start, but this is for a different application. So just go ahead, grab the link, um, send this to me however you guys want, um, and I will try and assist you with actually debugging League of Legends on Linux and I will be starting the debug process and the new wine scripts to get it working as well as it does for me on my current version. I'll be starting that with the new alpha client uh, once Riot actually forces me to move over as I don't feel it necessary to put in all that effort when I don't have to. So um, thanks for watching guys, like, rate, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. I know it was a really short video but um, this was kind of a response video to some people that had a bit of problems installing. So. Uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Cheers.